All right. The other day, we did, what did we do the other day? Do you guys remember what we did? What's one thing we did the other day that we talked about? Um, we were working with the dollhouse. Mm -hmm. We had different questions. Like, what was the perimeter of the dollhouse? How many things you can make out of legs? Mm -hmm. What else? Who wants to add something about what we did? What, what do you want to add? We read a paragraph and he asked us, he asked us to say one word that we, um, that we knew or did. That we heard. Mm -hmm. So we sort of did a what do you hear, right? So he asked, what do you hear when we're talking about, well, today we're going to do what do you see? Okay, so what do you see? So I'm going to start by drawing. All right. So this is a table. And every year at this one school, the um, parents have a special tea for the teachers because the teachers are special and you like to make the teachers feel special. So they have a tea and they set up the tables in the cafeteria. So here's one of the tables and this it's a shape of, do you get, who knows what shape that is? Who knows, what shape is that? Trapezoid. How'd you know that? I heard it. You, you just, you've just known that, all right? So here's another one. So that's one table. So there's two tables. Okay. Now what I want you to do is I want you to talk to your neighbor. Tell him something you saw. Talk to your neighbor. Just real quick. Okay. So let's see what we uh, All right, can I have everybody attention back here for a second? We're gonna we're gonna kind of do this again. We're gonna quickly go. So what's one thing that you guys talked about that you saw in the picture? Go ahead. Okay. How about what's one thing you guys saw in the picture? Okay, how about you guys? Those are two trapezoids that form the parallelogram. Okay, how about you guys? Um, with the trapezoid on the first one, with the dots, they, if you connected them, they would make a pentagon. Okay, how about you guys? Do you, do you have two groups back there? No. Okay, so what's one thing that you guys talked about? <laughs> we saw that the, one, the bottom trapezoid together made like an upside down shape, and there were more seats on that tape, the tables connected. And the one on the top. Mm -hmm. How about you guys? Parallel. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, do you want me to take the blue paper down? You can see see how you did. Okay. All right. Talk to your neighbors just for one minute about. Do you see anything different? Do you need to change anything you talked about? Okay. Or well, like it could be half square. It could be square. Oh yeah, it could. Like, like, yeah. Is there anything that you saw that was different, or like anything else that you that we missed? It was like the same thing. Yeah. All right. So let's hear from some people. Let's start back here. What's uh, is there anything that you guys uh, revised or at, wanted to add? What did you guys? In the parallelogram, we saw two trapezoids. Mm -hmm. Okay, how about you guys? We, we counted the seats and there were 13. Okay, All right. how about you two? Is there anything else you wanted to add? Uh, two trapezoids no. on the bottom did a rotation. Uh huh, okay, how about you guys? The two trapezoids looked like it was a big one and also stable like all the stuff in Okay, how about you guys? Um, on the second one, the one trapezoid flipped over. Mm hmm. It, it was facing down instead of up this time. Okay. All right. And how about this side? What's one? Th what did you guys talk about? Anything new? Um, for the second table, we saw two two trapezoids connected. Uh -huh. 
Okay. Anything anyone wants to add that they thought was really important that we haven't said yet? What would you like to add? Um, that second picture, it turned and it made it a 180 degrees. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Now, what did I say at the beginning? What, what are these things? What did I say? That, uh, I'll take it down so we can look at it, okay? What did you guys say? Uh-huh. So what does, now with your partner, what are some things that you are wondering about this? All right. talk, talk to your neighbors and see what are you wondering about it. So these are tables. The round things, someone asked earlier, are the round things chairs? They are chairs. Talk amongst yourselves. See what, what questions this make you think of. What are you curious about? How many teachers do you have? Yeah, like how many teachers do you have? Yeah, like seeds per grade. Yeah, like how many seats? How many seats could fit the teachers and parents? What are you guys thinking about? Anything else? How many tables? Three tables. Okay. Five. So you mean you, would you add more chairs than are there, or are you thinking of the chairs that are there? Nine seats. Nine seats. Five. Five. Three. 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 Well, what do you guys have for some ideas? Long rectangular prism. No, I don't think so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. I actually could. Well, this is a pentagon. I could actually erase these because they, they might be a little bit confusing. How would they go? Does that get rid of some of your wonderings? But you know what they really were? So that I didn't draw my picture too big, the paper would still cover it up. That was a secret, but I didn't do a very good job making it. Oh wait, this is. All right, so I know some of you are still wondering, but let's um, let's get some ideas of some of the sorts of things your group has been talking about. So let's start on this side first. What's one thing you guys are wondering about over here? Um, well, why the tables were shaped that way? Mm hmm Okay. How about right up front here? What's one thing you guys were wondering about? Why are there two tables? Why are there two tables? Uh huh. Okay. How about you guys? Why the chairs are are like dots. Mm -hmm. Okay. How about you guys? Um, um, what shape could be made if connected the dots? Okay. And how about in the back? What's one thing you guys are wondering about? We were wondering if, because usually the tables aren't shaped like trapezoids, so we were wondering if like it's a special place, mm -hmm. like they were made specially, mm -hmm. they made like that. Okay. How about you guys? Like how many teachers there were and how many tables you would need. Mm -hmm. And I like your, your question of, that you're wondering about the trapezoid tables just because um, I've been in some schools where they, that's all they have in their classroom is tables that are shaped like trapezoids. So instead of tables that are shaped like rectangles, they have trapezoids. And it's kind of cool, but you can't line them easily up in a row like this. Cool. All right, so here's your next question that you're going to figure out. If this picture, so we got one table, we have some people sitting at it, or some chairs at least. We have two tables. Right? What sorts of questions do you think a teacher might ask if they were to put this picture on a test? All right, so talk in your group and say, talk to your partner, and let's come up with some ideas, and then we'll, we'll list them. Like how many teachers could sit there? Yeah, because it, it doesn't have to be just one seat. It doesn't have to be like one like person. Bench. Yeah, it could be like a bench, but it's like just a symbol for it. Yeah. Yeah. So it be how many teachers and tables could you fit? What do you think that um? Yeah, because yeah, the the cage itself. Five together. Um, would be a quadrilateral. Yeah. Patrick, just think of it. These sides are the same, but their sides are down. Don't you think that's a little bit, you know, uneven? Uh, yeah, it may be uneven. Well, no. One side's going. 
Well, if connected two trapezoids together, they would be the same, wouldn't they? Mm. No. No, Patrick, because just remember, these sides are diagonal, so it can't be the same. Yeah, that's my idea. All right, everybody. So let's let's see. I, I've listened to some of you, but I'm curious what everybody is thinking about. So we're going to actually make a list of some of the questions that you've come up with. And so, so let's start on this side. What's one question that you guys think your teacher might ask and, uh, if this picture were to show up on a test? What do you think? With, 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 with the area. Okay. What would the area be? Okay. All right. How about in the back? What's one question you guys came up with? Like the question that they asked, like if you put the dot, connected the dots together, connected the chairs together, what kind of shape it would make? Okay. All right. How about you guys? What's one question that you guys came up how with? How much tea do you need and how many people can be seated at one table? Okay. Alright, how about you guys right here? Um, how many people would be able to fit on the tables if we put about five? Five which? Five tables together. Five tables. Alright, how about you guys? What's one question? The same as how many people seated at one table. So this one again? Okay, so we get two people to do that one. Alright, so how about over here? What's the question that you guys came up with? How many teachers can sit at one table? How many teachers is there which? How many teachers can sit at one table? Can sit at one table. So this one again? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. So did anyone have any other questions that they would really like to add? So what's the question that you were thinking of? Um, how many inches would it be? How many inches would which be? The table. Okay. What would you like to add? Eight. How many centimeters would the table be? Okay. Inches or centimeters. Right. What do you get? What is the perimeter of the tables added together? Okay. 